my name is Sabine and welcome to another video. <laughs> As you guys can see, I'm not alone for this one. Here we have Leora. I have to say this with my Dutch accent. I, I always say Leora yeah. and then people are like, oh, that's hard. So today we are going to do the guess that book challenge. So I said the guess the book challenge, but it's like the first sentence of a book. So Leora is going to randomly pick some books from my can shelf. I, can I like introduce myself? Yeah, I so totally you. forgot that. Yeah. I have a YouTube channel, but it's in Dutch. So like you won't understand it. Like sometimes I do subtitling, but I'm very lazy and like subtitling is a lot of work, so I don't mm -hmm. do it regularly. Yeah. But I do it for some videos, so I've got some videos that you could watch. Yeah, but mm -hmm. you also have like artsy videos without really yeah, I, yeah, saying I have, anything, like, right? I do do book videos, but I do like, sometimes I make book videos. I don't know. Yeah. It's, not, it's not like a... She's not a booktube book book channel. Yeah. She's just like... Book I'm a mixture. <laughs> yeah, she's a mixture of everything. Also, I want to say that my English is very weird. It has like tens of thousands of different accents in it, and so... If it sounds weird, I'm sorry, I can't help. It's very unpredictable, but very fun. Oh, my channel's called Mind Daisy. Yeah, my, you have to know her channel name because otherwise... Oh, go check it out. Yeah. <laughs> mm -mm. Give her some subscribers, people. You're just going to randomly pick some books from my shelves. Yeah, and the idea was that I put this on your head. I will read the mm -hmm. first sentence and then you will... I have to guess. guess. ...what book it is. Can we, like, set a time... a timer? Yeah, that's maybe good because otherwise it can just go on and on. It's like a minute a good uh, time. Yeah, maybe that's long. I yeah, 30 seconds to yeah, think or something. Let's do three each. So so, um, can you blindfold me? <laughs> it's hard for me to do myself. Okay. Can you still see through that? Uh, I'm, no. I'm, I'm, defini I'm definitely ruining your hands. <laughs> it's fine. Oh, <laughs> this looks ridiculous. <laughs> Maybe you should, like, move so I can... Yeah, okay, wait. If you help me... <laughs> this is already a very interesting video. <laughs> so many books, but, like, I probably... We both, I think we both have like the same amount, but I'm still like so astonished at everything. Yes. I pick the books, don't take the blindfold off, no, I'll no, lead no. you to each Okay, yeah, thank you. I'm closing yeah. my eyes, so I cannot see anything at all. Okay, I will give you a few hints. Okay, a okay. Few tips. Mm -hmm. Okay, so this is the first book I've picked, and I recently talked about this on my own channel, okay. and it's one of my favorite reads ever. Oh my god. <laughs> Um, and I recently read it, and I read it in one day, in an astonishing three hours. Wait, wait what the crap? So I'm gonna read the first sentence, and then I'm immediately gonna put the timer on. Mm -hmm. Oh shit, I think you'll definitely guess it, because it's got like the main characters. Okay, but you can skip the name. Skip okay, the name. I can skip the yeah. name. Mm -hmm. It's the kind of name you give to the creepy girl who clings to her ex-boyfriend for weeks after he's dumped her, because she refuses to accept that he hates her guts. It's on. The crap? It's, and if you can read it in three hours, it, in three hours, it is probably supposed to be kind of short, I'm guessing, or you can read it really quickly. To a guy who broke up with her. Okay, can I read it again? Yeah. Okay, so hmm hmm is the kind of name you give to the creepy girl who clings to her ex-boyfriend for weeks after he's dumped her because she refuses to accept that he hates her guts. I think it's supposed. Is it? I think it's gonna be contemporary, but I don't know. Uh. <laughs> and that's thirty seconds. I mean, <laughs> You, I was also thinking, like, which books have you read recently? I think I watched your wrap up, but I don't know. Okay, you you do? This was Eliza and their monsters. <gasps> oh my god! Wait, that's a pretty big book! Yeah, I know! Girl, three hours! Okay, I still need to read that one. Oh my god. I just realized that, like, the half of this video, you'll be blindfolded <laughs> in front of the camera. <laughs> this is the next book. Yeah. And I haven't read this book, but it was mm -hmm. recently in one of your videos. Mm. And I just thought the cover was the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. I think you already know. It's not I think fair. I have an idea, but not. I don't think I've read the first sentence of this one. Three sisters arrive in Sparrow, Oregon, in 1822 aboard a fur trading ship named the Lady Astor, which sank later that year in the harbor just beyond the cape. I know this one! It's yeah. the Wicked Deep! Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> it's a beautiful cover. I was like, okay. Mm, I yeah, but I commented it. about this. Like, I, I, I digged my own grave saying that. But it was like, look how beautiful this is, guys. And then it said something about three sisters in a town. I was like, okay. So the next book is a really big book. Oh god. But this book is one I've always wanted to read, but I've never really talked about it, and I've never really picked it up. You've got an interesting copy of this one. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, it's a very short sentence. So oh, this will be oh pretty god. hard. Uh, okay, so the first sentence is. Everything had gone horribly wrong. <laughs> this could be anything. I mean, like, what the crap? I want to give you a, a hint. Yeah, please. The hint please. is that there is a Sarah J. Maas quote on the cover. A Sarah J. Maas quote? So she's saying something about yeah, this yeah. book. Yeah, I think it's going to be like a fantasy book because it's Sarah J. Maas. Um, Everything had gone horribly wrong. It's got look, witches in it. It's got witches in it. It goes with... Uh, God damn it. You're out of time. It's You're Truth right. Witch from Sitting Dead. Oh, God. It's yeah. such a big copy. You can take the blindfold off, by the way. Jesus Christ! This is a really big book! Have you seen 
seen this? Yeah, it's ginormous. And I it's mean, also like, it's a library yeah. thing? Oh I my god, the know. light. Well, you also said it up. has witches in it. It literally says truth witch on the Yeah, front no, I, was, I was like, okay, she's got five seconds. I'm making it easy for her. But you were like, oh, oh I witches. still didn't get it. <laughs> I'm gonna also blindfold you and now I can try to make it really hard for you. No, I don't, because I try to make it easy for yeah, you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, but I'm definitely gonna give you like tips and stuff like okay, that. This oh. is a very weird experience to have someone blindfold you. <laughs> On camera for you too. Feels kinda sexual. <laughs> I'm gonna sit that way. I'm just gonna try. I don't know. I'm gonna sit on my bed. I feel like it's a bit unfair because I don't know all the books that you own. And okay. like you know what books you own. Uh huh. Uh, that's true. I'm gonna just quickly grab some things. I'm trying to be comfortable here, but your bed's really high, so I'm like, <laughs> what, what is this? I wanna grab one that's all the way down the bottom. This is a 2017 release. It was super popular. Um, I think this is so hard. Yeah, it's really, really hard. And it's it doesn't take place in modern times. Yeah? Oh, okay. Okay, so I'm gonna read the first oh sentence. Oh my god, I don't know how much historical fiction I've read. There's also a name from a character in here, so I'm just gonna bleep that one out just like you did. On the morning we are to leave for our grand tour of the continent, I wake in bed beside... Hmm, hmm, hmm. I know, I know. I think you've read it, but I'm, I'm not too sure. It hey, has... have you put the timer on? Yeah, I put the timer it's on. It's The Gentleman's Guide to Bison Verse. Oh my god, girl! <laughs> yes, it but is! But I love this book so much, so I'll... I knew. I knew when you started reading, my face was going like... Ew. Oh my god, that was so quickly. And now I'm feeling like... <laughs> you might guess all of the ones that I picked. This is a book that you also have. Okay. And that is all I'm gonna say right now, because I feel you don't like... You want to make it too easy. No, I think it's gonna be really easy. But uh, we shall see. So, the first sentence is, Here is everything I know about France. Madeleine and Amélie and Moulin Rouge. So that is all that I'm gonna do about you. I have this and book in Moulin Dutch, Rouge. so it is harder, because I don't... Oh, I know, I know, it's Anna and the French. <laughs> I talked about it in my five favorite books of the moment as well. Oh, I've got and I was like, this is kind of a bad book, but it also yeah, kind of really like good. Yeah, it's like a really guilty pleasure type yeah. of read. The last book. Um, I've already won. You've already won. You have. Should I, for this time, not give you any clues? Okay. Because so you've already won, so we're gonna make it a little. You're, bit... make, you're making it harder on me, which is not fair. But you've already won, so. Okay. okay. <laughs> they said only the folk who belonged in that shot after dark were the ones who were up to no good. Start. Is it a uh, is it never night? Nope. Oh shit. I don't have that one with me. Can you here. read it again? They said the only folk who belonged in dead shot after dark were the ones who dead were shot? up to no good. Do you know what that is in Dutch? <laughs> No. I don't know. I think I have Dead them in Dutch. I don't know. I don't think you have them in Dutch because dead shot was you talked about this with me. Did I talk about this? Mhm. Mm is it like the um... oh shit? I know the cover. Is it by Victoria Schwab? Nope. Oh shit, I don't know. You and didn't give me a hint! Over. Give me a hint! Well, okay, you did not give me any hint! You said that the covers were really ugly in the Dutch version. It's about the girl in the desert. Yeah, my yeah, favorite book. Yeah, but that's because I didn't read that. Like, how was I supposed to know? <laughs> no, that's true, but I was like, maybe she can get that. That's unfair. But the world is so bright. Yeah, I know. Are you crying? No, I'm not crying. <laughs> are, you, are you crying? Are you okay? get re like really proper competitive so when you were like i'm not giving you any answer i was like girl injustice <laughs> but i still won she still won Leora won she did a really good job she got two out of the three books i got one so i'm still happy that i got at least a point we will also be filming a couple of other videos for her channel so you guys can go check out her channel to see those once she has edited them edit quickly yeah, and I, I don't, so I think your videos will be up sooner than mine. Go check Click them the out. link in the description box. Down below. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and you guys can subscribe to my channel by clicking somewhere here on the screen or on the button down below. You guys can also follow me on all of my social different... Social different medias. Yeah, you, you can do that. I have Goodreads, I have Snapchat, I have Instagram. I, I really should start putting my Goodreads also in my description yeah. box because I don't, I've never done that. But I, I will should. put yours in mine as well. Thank you again so much for watching and I hope that I will see you guys in the next one. Bye bye!